A Greenville resident will tell you that this beautiful spot in the foothills of the Blue Ridge is a fine place to live. Located in the heart of the Piedmont Plateau, this area has lots of elbow room for ample growth. Donaldson Center is an excellent example of how Greenville plans ahead. When the federal government built Donaldson Air Force Base on this site, Greenville County retained sole ownership of the land and made provision that any buildings on the land would revert to the county should the government choose to close the base. Now, Donaldson Center, a business and industrial park, is the result of that foresight of years ago. This center has been a model for many other areas of the Southeast who face the same potential problem of military shutdown. The climate is perfect for water sports on the Saluda River or nearby Lake Hartwell. Here, people from the Greenville area can find excellent water for boating, water skiing, or putting in at a convenient marina for a snack. Here also is the home of the imposing Hartwell Dam, whose generators supply electricity to the Piedmont regions of South Carolina, North Carolina, and some sections of Georgia. Over the entire scene loom the magnificent Blue Ridge Mountains, surrounding Greenville on three sides. The Blue Ridge chain of the Appalachians towers to an altitude of 3,400 feet. And from these mountains, the rolling Piedmont Plateau serves as the shelf upon which the city of Greenville rests at some 3,000 feet above sea level. Greenville residents think of the spectacular Blue Ridge Mountains as a very special part of their everyday living, whether for traveling on or just plain looking at. How did it happen? How did sleeping little Pleasantburg become big, booming, bustling Greenville in just under a century? one of the fastest growing metropolitan areas of the South. Well, it took a lot of planning with a sharp eye on the future. And there's more to be done.